I remember watching a Los Angeles Lakers game. On the first possession of the game, Kobe Bryant gets the ball and the opposing team's crowd boos. Kobe ignores the noise, drives to the basket, slam dunk. Next possession, Kobe Bryant gets the ball and the crowd boos even louder. Yet again, he ignores the noise, takes his shot, and scores. At the end of the game, a reporter asked Kobe, did the booing crowd intimidate you? And Kobe replied, boos don't block dunks. What he meant by that was that once you've mastered your ability to make your shot, what the crowd thinks is irrelevant. What that means for you and I is that when we have dreams and goals, all that matters is our ability to focus on the results we want to create and get things done. And if you can do that, it doesn't matter what the haters and the doubters think. So many times we waste our energy justifying our dreams and trying to prove to other people that we have what it takes to make things happen. And every second that you spend doing that is a second that could be spent on actually realizing those dreams, on actually putting in the work. Imagine what would have happened had Kobe stopped in the middle of the game and started arguing with the opposing fans, pleading with them to recognize his talent. They would have lost. The same is true of your dreams. If you interrupt your creative process and stop working on your dreams in order to argue with the people who don't believe in you or who don't recognize your talent, you're gonna lose out on the game of life. Just as boos don't block dunks, critics don't kill creativity unless you let them. Don't let them.